Microworld GX logo, lesson 28. Topic today, backgrounds. You go up to the top of the screen here and click on the color palette again. It's got many things on it. If you click in the middle here, or the first, second one I should say, backgrounds, you've got all kinds of backgrounds that you can make the whole screen, kind of like a uh, set background with a color. We're going to make a new page though, upper upper corner here, upper left, by the air, blue and blue arrows left and right. We'll make a new page, clear this all off. Don't worry, the other page is still there. We'll make a make a little error there. Let's take this first one here in upper right hand corner, background A1. I like to click in the upper corner. When you click in the upper corner, it fills it perfectly. And it has this little square here. You can then make it all drag over, make the whole background. If you don't like that, I guess you can delete it. Take another one maybe, click in the upper corner. Once you get this cursor here, this square uh, arrows, you got all these backgrounds to choose from. And which one do I like best? I don't know. Let's take a sunset here or sky. I like to do it the whole page. You can do it half the page, whatever. If you go previous page, you can go back to where you were. There's a transition there, by the way. If you go next page, you can tell a story by setting the background. Now the trouble is, well, now what? Let's make a turtle here. This one didn't have a turtle. I'll just click a turtle, hatch it. You don't see it. Hmm. Well, if you drag with your hand, there's the turtle. If you right click, right click, send it back. It sends us to the back, but we still don't see the turtle. Let me go to the uh, shapes page. I like that penguin. Nah, maybe we'll go to the house here. Click it to the house. We'll drag the background up, over, and then we'll right click, send it to the back. Still can't see the turtle. Oh well. Show turtle. We will right click the uh, turtle and we'll bring it to the front. It's kind of like layering, different layers. Well, let's try this then. Stamp the background. There we go. Stamp the background, it's stamped. It's not going to move now. Now, if you CG it, if you CG it, it is gone and the turtle goes back to the center. Let's go back to the backgrounds. Go back to the one I had here. Click, drag, right click, send to the back, right click, stamp or stamp full page. There you go. Then you don't have to worry about trying to get it perfectly. Here's the turtle. It moves. The background doesn't move. By the way, before I forget, if you type in presentation mode, presentation mode, it gets rid of everything. Then uh, you can see everything on the screen. Gets rid of all the extra stuff. Up here, by the way, this little box here, way up in the corner, by the turtle, to the left of the turtle, presentation mode. Let's uh, CG it. Let's get another one here, maybe this one. Right click, stamp full page, there's the turtle. Let's say I want to make the turtle into a horse or something. Open the backpack, go to the shapes. Let's see, find something that we like. Maybe a person. Let's see, get the shapes first of all. This one's called Schoolboy. Set the shape. Now that it's in the backpack, set the shape to Schoolboy. And we can move it around. We can make it bigger. We can change directions. We can tell a story. 
We can go back and forth between pages with transitions. We can do all kinds of things. How many backgrounds do you have? Oh my. Boy, do you have a lot of backgrounds all ready for you. You can stamp them, size them. Uh, what are all these? I don't know. Once they're stamped, once they're stamped, you can notice that it tries to put it on top of the other one, but we don't want that. We would probably just make a new page and bring that here. Right click, stamp. We can do freeze the background, and if you freeze the background, it's it's done. This one, let's see, we'll freeze the background. When you freeze the background, when you CG it, it doesn't go away. When you CG it, it doesn't go away. If you unfreeze it and you CG it, it's gone. So we can put new turtles, we can put new characters, we can have new backgrounds, and the possibilities, once again, are endless.